Hello everybody, this is Admiral. So a couple of days ago, I saw a post on the Minecraft Reddit about how you can create purple particle effects by placing an ender chest under a block. And I thought this looked really cool. So using the new command block features, I made a version that is toggleable, and the particles are actually a lot bigger. So this diamond looks really cool by itself, especially when you have fancy graphics enabled. But it looks a lot cooler when you flick this lever and you can create these purple particle effects around it. So this is a really cool feature. You could definitely use this in an adventure map or some sort of PvP game or even in server spawn or something. Uh, I think it's really cool and it's got some versatility to it. So you can also use it to showcase a certain block type if you lower the floor. So this beacon block, it looks like all the particles are going into it, which is also really cool. And it's just this small thing over here that controls it all. So how it works is it actually spawns an ender pearl in the space right here. So when I turn this on, an ender pearl is repeatedly spawned right there. And wherever an ender pearl collides, it creates this cool purple particle effect. So I just put a block right here and it actually collides with this block right here and it creates a particle effect right here. So it can't be a transparent block, otherwise you can see the ender pearl and it kind of ruins the effect. But when you do it with a solid block, it's hard to tell how it works and it looks really cool. Like I said, this is the device that spawns in the ender pearls. It fits into a 3x3 three three area, which is pretty cool. And to toggle it, just toggle this piston. So when it's extended, it'll spawn in the ender pearls. And when it isn't, it won't spawn in the ender pearls. So it's pretty self-explanatory. This just spawns in the ender pearls 10 blocks above the command block, but it's really tweakable. So if you wanted this to spawn at specific coordinates, you could easily set that up. Or you can make it spawn at, let's say, 20 blocks above the command block and it'll spawn way up there so you could definitely fit this into any scenario in which you need to use it the mc edit schematic for this will be in the description and this world download will also be in the description so if you don't really know how to use mc edit you can just check out the world download and build one for yourself so as always thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this i think it's a very cool feature and i will see you guys later